Hello students, let us learn how to divide two polynomials from the third topic from standard 9th maths part 1. We know how to do arithmetic operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication of two polynomials. In today's session, we are going to learn how to divide two polynomials that is division of polynomials. Suppose if we have to divide two numbers that is if we have to divide 14 by 3, we take 14 in the division sign as it is a dividend and divisor is 3 that's why we write 3 outside the division sign and then we divide 14 by 3 as 3 folds are 12 so quotient is 4 and if we subtract 12 from 14 we'll get 2 as a remainder. In this division process 14 is dividend, 3 is divisor, 4 is a quotient and 2 is the remainder. We can write these dividend, divisor, quotient and remainder in the form dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder which can be verified as 14 is equal to 3 into 4 plus 2. So this is the procedure to divide two numbers. Now we are going to use the same procedure for the division of polynomials. Let us consider the example. Divide the first polynomial by the second. The first polynomial is x cube minus 64 and we have to divide it by x minus 4. Firstly we will give a name to this polynomial as p of x is equal to x cube minus 64. As we can see here, this polynomial is not in the standard form. So first of all, we have to write it in the standard form. That is, we have to write the terms in the given polynomial in the descending order of power of x. That is x cube plus x square term is not there. So we should write it 0x square plus x term is also not there. So it is 0x minus lastly the constant term 64. Now in this polynomial all the terms are in the descending order of power of x so this is in the standard form. Now we have to divide this polynomial so we should write the polynomial x cube plus 0x square plus 0x minus 64 inside the division sign and x minus 4 by which we have to divide the first polynomial so we write that outside the division sign. Now we have to compare the first terms of dividend and divisor that is x cube and x. If we multiply x by x square we will get x cube. So in quotient we have to write x square and we have to multiply both the terms x and minus 4 by x square so as to get x cube minus 4x square. Then we have to subtract this from the first two terms of dividend as we know that while subtracting we have to change the sign of each term in the second algebraic expression. So plus x cube will become minus x cube and minus 4x square will become plus 4x square. And here plus x cube and minus x cube will get cancelled and 0x square plus 4x square will get 4x square. Now to proceed with the division process we have to write the next term in the dividend that is 0x so as to get the algebraic expression 4x square plus 0x. Again we have to compare first two terms that is x and 4x square. If we multiply x by 4x we will get 4x square that's why in quotient we should write plus 4x. And now we have to multiply both the terms of divisor by 4x. That is we have to multiply x and minus 4 by 4x. So 4x into x we will get 4x square and 4x into minus 4 we will get minus 16x. Again we have to subtract the second algebraic expression from the first one. So while subtracting we have to change the signs. So plus 4x square will become minus 4x square and minus 16x will become plus 16x. Here again plus 4x square and minus 4x square 
will get cancelled and 0x plus 16x we will get 16x. So again we have to proceed by taking the next term of the dividend that is minus 64. Now if you multiply x by 16 we will get 16x that's why in quotient we should write plus 16 and multiply both the terms x and minus 4 by 16 so as to get 16x minus 64. Here also subtraction is to be done. So while subtracting plus 16x will become minus 16x and minus 64 will become plus 64. Here the both plus 16x minus 16x and plus 64 and minus 64 will get cancelled and we will have the remainder 0. In this process x square plus 4x plus 16 is a quotient and 0 is remainder x cube plus 0x square plus 0x minus 64 is a dividend and x minus 4 is the divisor. And now we can write all this in the form that is dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder. Here the dividend is x cube minus 64 is equal to divisor is x minus 4 into quotient is x square plus 4x plus 16 plus and we have got the remainder 0. So this is how we can divide any two polynomials by a traditional method. I hope you understand the concept. If you like this content, please subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching.